sweating. Like I was just sweating. You know what I'm saying? Waking up wet. So I got up and, and cold came up. Now, <laughs> spit in the toilet. And I noticed my throat wasn't hurting as bad. Because every day I was waking up. I'm talking about in the morning is when it's rough. Waking up. Then we still sleeping in the air. The house cold. So, you know, um, I used to have to warm up in the bathroom, spray some of this. I had ibuprofen, 800s, the pain. And I had some CBD pain rub, man. I was trying to do everything. So, woke up this morning, and I just was feeling better. I'm like, Okay, you know, you still have a little, but my pain went from 10 times of a sore throat to probably sore throat times probably one. And how I was feeling, I could take this little pain swallow. So that let me know that that tea is working. You know what I'm saying? The old pad tea. And um, today is the wedding. And that's crazy how it's not hurting like it was on the day of the wedding. So we'll be doing the wedding today. I'll be officiating the wedding. And um, throat feel all right, man. So y'all just stay tuned, bro. But um, take care of yourself out there, man. You know, you never know what's going on, man. Um, That's the only kind of symptoms that I had, you know. Um, I never lost my appetite. I still was eating, but swallowing hurting, hurting, hurting. So we went, we wound up going to a little restaurant today. It was a welcome dinner. I ordered me some soup and some shrimp and I eat the soup. I don't know if it was from the salt or whatever going down, but it was like smooth, soothed in my throat. But the soup, supposed to be gumbo, were looking like red beans and rice. <laughs> you know, they only can cook that gumbo in the wild. But um, other than that, man, and then somebody wound up catching a heart attack that was with us. Um, So he had to, he fell out, hit his head, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Passed out. Had to go to the ambulance, go to the doc hospital. That kind of like shook the day a little bit. We got back to the house, pardoned the neighbor down the street, called the police on us. So I'm asleep, cause y'all know I'm on the bamboo. I look up, two cops, police right in our face. I'm like, man, you know they spooked me. They were like, y'all gotta um, turn the music off, it's after hours, blah, 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 whatever. So we wind up doing that and um, other than that, today's Saturday now. I feel a whole lot better. Whole lot better. Look, they coming from the beach. They not with us though. They just went to the beach. They leaving now. So yeah. That was my um vlog. Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And let me know what y'all think. That tea is called the old path. T H E O L D P A T H. Y'all go to the oldpad.com. If you feeling any kind of symptoms or any kind of sickness, disease, you know, it works, y'all. It works. It works. I wouldn't be telling y'all nothing. I didn't get paid to advertise. Or, None of that. Your boy was feeling down. Now I'm back up, baby. So y'all make sure y'all tune in. Um, I ain't gonna be able to have my phone filming, so y'all might get a lot of the after party, cause um your boy officiating the wedding. So I'm the preacher. Can y'all imagine that? I went from performing at weddings to officiating the wedding. That's big. First one. Shout out to Kirk, shout out to Tiff, the Hollands, baby. I'ma holler at y'all.